third met fourth at Tannadice with Dundee United looking to close the nine point gap to Motherwell. Ainsworth who scored spectacularly up here in September and well across and Sutton just couldn't meet it at the back post. Flicked on by Hutchinson and Sutton prowling around the six yard line. Spread wide by Chifchi for Watson. Quick ball into Mackay Stephen. Back it comes to Watson and first time into the middle. Over hit, but Rankin arriving late. And it squeezes just wide of the target from John Rankin. Scored the winner here against Kilmarnock on Saturday. Almost opening the scoring against Motherwell. Stretching for it, but he controlled it well. Watson forward for Armstrong and a burst of pace from Stuart Armstrong. Cut back towards Armstrong and a vital challenge from Zane Francis Angol. That was crucial. Chief Chi, delicate touch on, but Motherwell can clear up. Dundee United dominating the early stages. Armstrong. Straight up into the air, though. Header one. Mackay Stephen flicks on. Hutchinson looks for his goalkeeper, but that's woefully short. And Ryan Dow does open the scoring. Midway through the first half, Dow pounces on a catastrophic error by Sean Hutchinson. It seems so simple just to send it back to the goalkeeper. The misjudgment in weight from Hutchinson, and Dow made no mistake. And this is first start of 2014, the 22-year-old gets his second goal of the season. Certainly didn't panic when faced with Gunnar Nielsen, one-on-one. -on -one. Leslie with the free kick. Sutton wins the first header, Vigers! Very good stop by Czerzniak, Vigers still has it. Dundee United can eventually clear. Well, Sutton as ever winning those first headers. Vigers denied by an excellent save. Mackay Stephen quickly into the path of Ryan Dow now. Who can he pick out? Armstrong blocked Chifchi and blocked for the second time. Chifchi frustrated. And Sean Hutchinson makes a slight amends for his mistake that led to the opening goal with a courageous block. Dow in space. And probably the best chance fell to Armstrong. Dow then with the corner, flicked on, and there's Gunning! Just before half-time to score against his former club. It's his first goal for 13 months. Gavin Gunning makes it to Chifchi with the header at the front post. Well, possibly a foul on Hamill, but Gunning couldn't miss. Sutton's header. Peyton. Oh, and it's Peyton who's short this time. Vigers was interested. He was bundled over by Gunning. Bobby Madden. Didn't think that that was a penalty kick. Gunning certainly shielding the ball from Vigers as good came across. No real intention to play the ball at all by Gavin Gunning. And have Dundee United got away with one there. Chifchi straight away from kickoff. And he's making good progress and he's won the free kick. And had Bobby Madden played on, Ryan Dow was in. And what would have been a very quick start to the second half. Chifchi runs over it. Gunning strikes it, deflected! And what a start to the second half for Dundee United. It's Gavin Gunning with his second of the game. Deflected off McFadden. Oh, and by the look of that, James McFadden is not the man you want standing in and around a wall. Could have done better. 
McFadden lines up the free kick, deflected and over the top. McFadden asking the question here and Bobby Madden is pointing at the spot. Must have been a handball. Nadia Chifchi has been yellow carded. McFadden struck the free kick. The arm goes up from Chifchi. That is a penalty kick. John Sutton to pull it back to 3-1. Well, the last three meetings between these two teams have had four goals in them. John Sutton ensures the fourth of this game and we are far from finished. Dow takes and a man at the back. Armstrong arriving. Well, his first touch was perfect to set up the shot, quick feet. Dow's free kick. Gunning at the back post, there was Armstrong, flashed wide. Dundee United's victory over Kilmarnock was their first in the league since pre-Christmas. Could they be going for two in a row? Missed by Armstrong, but it will come to Mackay Stephen. And then Armstrong can't find a way past Gunnar Nielsen. Well, I don't think Stuart Armstrong can tell you that he meant that. Good chance at the second attempt. Fadden, it's a long throw. Francis Angol couldn't turn it in. Was that a handball by Gavin Gunning? He got away with one decision in the first half and perhaps a second there, defending against Sanier. Going for the long throw again. Sanier! Well, Motherwell came from 3-2 down to beat Partick Thistle 4-3 at the weekend. They're looking to mount a comeback here. Rankin. Chifchi has dropped deep, strikes it from range. Well over the top in the end. He is a man who will shoot from anywhere. Just one league goal since October, though. And the full-time whistle has blown. A big win for Jackie McNamara's Dundee United. They close the gap on Motherwell in third to six points. A convincing victory. Gavin Gunning back to haunt his old side with two goals. The final score at Tannadice, Dundee United 3, Motherwell 1. Subscribe now for free and catch all the action on SPFL YouTube.